they even find the, uh, any suspects in the case? Officer, did they even find any suspects in the dark case? Huh? That's not my business. Why nobody talking about it? Why? What's the top secret? What's the big no. secret? That's something it's, way beyond me. It's way beyond you? Yeah. The the murder of young Doc is way beyond the police department? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, there, there's cameras in the, in the shop. This, there's cameras in the shop. Yeah, you're talking about secrets that I don't no, know about. Uh, secrets? Yeah. Now it's a secret. And I'm telling you right now, in hindsight, that cop scared me. Because when the camera was off, he used the word secret again. How is this some spooky secret? And you see why I don't believe them. Who killed young Dolph? Who killed Adolf Thornton? That's what he needs to be investigating. That's his job. But he's talking and using words like secret is spooky. That's the family dollar right there. That's the family dollar. All right, Jordan HD is here. I am here. All that talk, all that Sean is not going. Sean is scared. I am here. I am here. Yes. R.I.P. to Young Dolph. We're going to show our respect right now. We made it. We're going to show our respect. See what everybody needs. And they got pictures. They got real pictures. Real pictures now. This is pictures of Young Dolph in different various places. Cookie shop, the stuff. School, with school kids. You're looking at it right now. People wrote on the sidewalk. People wrote everywhere. Teddy bears. Was the shop. This was the shop. That was the shop. Mm -hmm. That's the gas station right there. I believe that's the gas station. Not sure, but I will find out and we will go to the gas station. You know what I'm saying? If it's that important. But I just want y'all to see. Where I'm at, what's going on? Sean in HD TV. All right, we got Kansas City in the building. Um, why you here? Tell the people why you here, man. Yeah, just pay uh -huh. some respects to the real king out here. Okay. The real Memphis king. And you love his music? Hell yeah. All right, and what you think about his unfortunate timing? Uh, I mean, wrong place at the wrong time. Okay. Uh, you know, he was just, he was just, in the community just right doing regular stuff right you know it's just unfortunate right just getting people's opinion on the matter i'm going down to the thing today i don't even have a ticket because i didn't know you needed a ticket but yeah you heard him kansas city is in the building we're here with a commoner rachel she's right over the bridge yes she's right over the water right there literally and we here and yeah so so tell the people what brought you here today because we wanted to come out show out right and off. you know what personally i think we shouldn't jump to conclusions like i know we at the cookie shop everybody's saying stuff i think we should wait right wait on what? we don't want to accuse nobody or nothing without no, evidence no, you no. feel me no. but look it was nice meeting y'all nice meeting rachel you. all right yes we here so this is the, you know what? They could have did better than this, man. I don't know, man. Ain't nothing over here, man. Nothing is over here. Nothing. It's just, you know, some factories that's not in production. Empty lots. You know, trucks, trailers. Nothing. 
and then this i mean they could have did a better job than this i mean what y'all think man right there man right there i seen the same car circling man it was two cars a black one pulled up right next to me tinted windows drove off and then a great maximum pulls up right across the street from me and watches me i was like you know what time to go you know what i'm saying time to go i was like time to go man you know what i mean and i'm out here dolo i'm like catching uber uber waiting for uber to take me from place to place so in the space that i'm waiting for the uber you know what i'm saying my guard is down you know what i mean and i'm waiting waiting and first car pulls up pulls up don't even just stop real quick then pulls off like it pulls up like it's pulling over drove off and then the second maxima came like five minutes later and just started watching me from across the street i said you know what i went inside this factory building just to cool off just to peep the scene you know what i'm saying just to i know how to move you got to know how to move you can't look spooky you can't be scared you can't be nervous so i just acted like i was going to work you feel me and i went inside the building i came out the dude as he's driving away he's looking now that that could be nothing that could be anything but i'm not in my area i'm out of town i'm in a hot zone i'm in a hot zone and i gotta be careful and be smart sean and hd tv now we head in the downtown area downtown right now driver yeah wow this is downtown wow, wow. small city like i mean like it's not even far from the hook like it's literally this is the big big this is the, the big big arena and it's like it's just right there from the hood like wow there's another Tennessee bridge. University, I how University of Tennessee. Bridge called a brown creeper. Wow. And it's only present in Mississippi in the wintertime. Uh, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Southwest Tennessee Community College is right here. Two, one, the university and the community college is right across the street from each other. Southwest Tennessee. Channel 13, Channel 13 News is here. Yeah. Oh, 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 he's the reporter. I'm sorry about that. Channel 13 is out here. All right, for sure. I'm Jeremy Pierre, news reporter here in Fox, Fox 13 here in Memphis, Tennessee. What's happening today, there's a celebration of life, public celebration of life here at the FedEx Forum. 
Um, must have a ticket to get in, but it's celebrating the life of Adolf Thornton Jr., better known as Young Dolph. The chief. All right, everybody, I'm downtown. I just spoke to a chief or a sheriff down here. He didn't want to be on the camera, but I'm telling you right now, guys, the spooky stuff already is starting. I spoke to him. He dropped a lot of info, exclusive info, that I think I should wait. But you know what? Being that I ain't posted nothing since I've been down here, Sean in HD in Memphis, Memphis in high definition. Rest in peace, young Dolph. And I'm about to break some very exclusive news nobody got. Matter of fact, I'm not even gonna do it yet. I'm just putting up this video so y'all can see I'm out here in the field. And right now I'm walking to the, to the cookie store or the factory, I'm not sure. Could be the factory, it look like a factory. It don't even look like a store on, on the map. But I'm heading there right now, I'm looking. I'm always cautious of my moves. And stop asking me, people asking me, why you ain't putting yourself on the camera? Listen, man, when it's time for me to do that, I'll do it. It's not about me. It's about getting the information. Yeah, you're gonna be entertained, but you're getting the information. And that's what you over here for, the real info. None of these YouTube dudes is out here. Look, I'm on the street. This is real street. This is real. I'm not making this up. Look, my hands are real. This is me. I'm not gonna show myself what I'm wearing, nothing right now. Just let me work. Let Sean and HD work. I got the exclusive that I'm about to drop. When I settle down, I'm going to drop the exclusive information none of these YouTubers got. Matter of fact, tell a friend to tell a friend, Sean and HD is about to break some news and it don't sound good. It's not good news. I'm about to break some news. Tell a friend right now to tell a friend. You see they building something over there. This is an office space right here. It's called Aloe World. I don't know what that is. And uh, yeah, man, we here. And um, it's, trust me, it's better to live down here. Out of all the downtowns I've been to, you know, maybe there's another safer neighborhood from down here. Like Baltimore is like that. Baltimore City is, is like crazy. And then when you go in the county areas, it's a little bit safer. So, and they're building stuff. And it's probably cheap to own a condo down here. It's probably not even that expensive. You know what I'm saying? But look, before I leave, you know I gotta have that cookie. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I and can you give it to me? I yeah, this is for sure. this is history right now. Yeah. This is epic right now. You know what cookie I'm about to get. There we go. It's Dove. Hey. That's right. I can't say good it like dude. him. He was a good but, dude. He was all right. Good dude. So, yeah. and you know what? I don't even want the cookie on the house because they were offering it to me out of out of love, out of Memphis love. But I want to show y'all how much it is important to support a black business, especially one that's been going through what they're going through. Mm -hmm. I support NYC support. Yeah. Sean and HD will purchase this cookie mm -hmm. right now. We Give me that it. three for five. I want three of them so I can bring back okay. some to my New Yorkers. Let them taste the cookie. You know, those that matter, let them taste the cookie. Let one or two of my kids taste the cookie as well. It's the deal. They got a deal here. Three for five, sixty. One, two, three, four, five, and change. And... We showing NYC love and courtesy here. And of course you gotta pay taxes. <laughs> 603. Yeah. <laughs> you know Everywhere. Yo, you guys don't know how historic this is that these people are pioneers. Uh, I'm tired of saying these people. Your last name is? My last name is Winton. Winton, yeah. the Winton family are pioneers okay let's let's the hills too now because the hills because right yeah. the hills 
the Wintons, correct? I yeah. said it right? Yeah. Pioneers. Guys, look, this is not, this is real. Support. And of course, I couldn't let her off the hook and her family off the hook. So I asked the big question, did you line up Dolph? You have a right to speak on the matter respectfully. Right. And how do you feel about the rumors and all that stuff? How do you feel about that? I think more so, you know what? I can't even blame mm -hmm. the, the YouTube channels mm -hmm. and everything because they're there for views. That's what they're there for. They're there right. for views, subscribers, and to make money. Right. They want to give you guys the, right. the hot topics uh, on what they think they know. Right. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I, I can't even blame them because they're doing their job, giving y'all news, giving y'all all this drama, this excitement. Oh, yeah, we know they did it because of right. this. But how they know anything about what happened inside that store, they exactly. weren't there, you know? Only people that I'm more disappointed in is the people that's actually listening. Right. That, that kind of hurts me that the people actually listening right. want to come and now they're ready to threaten me. They're ready to send death threats to my family, the, the, the prank phone calls, uh, you know, saying that, you know, my family deserve to die and things no. like that. You know, the right. unnecessary stuff. You guys have already like condemned us and, and put us in front of you all as you all being the jury saying, yeah, they had to do it. You know, right. but it's no proof out there that we did it. That kind of that kind of hurts me a little bit, because it's no reason for us to want this man gone. He was supporting us. He came in the store and supported us all the time. Showed us love. Why would we want to get rid of support? That's crazy. R.I.P. Adolf Thornton, A.K.A. Young Dolph, A.K.A. The New Black Wall Street, A.K.A. Sean and H.D. TV. Supports. Now, I also ask the other big question. I didn't come to Memphis to play games. I spoke to MPD. I spoke to police chief. I spoke to the ops. I went to the hood. I spoke to the regular people. I found out exactly what happened. But I know you guys want to know, what did she see officially? Me asking the question, did you kill Dov? Did your family lined up, Dolph? And now, what did you see, Raven? What did you see? What happened to young Dolph? Because it's all on camera. So whatever you say, the video will either contradict you or prove you right. Here we go. Short and HDTV. Can't stop. Won't stop. Uh, was he shot outside or inside the store? Based on your information. The people drove up mm -hmm. and shot him from outside the store. Okay. The dog was inside the store okay. when they drove up right. and they shot him. Mm. They were outside. Damn. He was inside. That okay. is what I meant. But people take my words right. over what they're saying it happened in the right. store. It didn't happen where the shooter came from the back, as you guys are thinking, <laughs> in the store. That's not what happened. The people came, Let's they drove up. Right. And they got out, right. and they shot and shot him from outside the store. Okay. The dog was inside the store okay. when they drove up, right. and they shot him. Mm. They were outside. Damn. He was inside. That okay. is what I meant. But people take my words right. over what they're saying it happened in the right. store. It didn't happen where the shooter came from the back, as you guys are thinking, <laughs> in the store. That's not what happened. The people came, Let's... they drove up. Right. And they got out, right. and they shot, right. and they shot. Look at the logo. Man, uh, I'm blue the gate. All right, so um, tell us what's happening today, man. Well, right now you're in front of the FedEx form. Uh -huh. You're essentially on B.B. King Street. You're about to attend a function. Kings. Which is oh, the wait a minute. B.B. King's, the, the jazz the jazz player? That's, that's right. That's Where's the this, spot at? I got to get in there. It's a restaurant. You can't see it's okay. a restaurant from here. All right. when, you up, when you go up Beale Street, right. it's all the way on the corner on the left side. All right. All, all right. right. Hey, how you street. doing? All right. I yeah. see you in the spirits. All right. So thank you guys, man. Thank you for letting me know the BB Kings all is right. around. The, that's that's classic. Right. I got right. it. I'm from New York, by the way. Right. New York is in the building. Let's make it happen. Make it move. Make it move. We kind of see on Dobby Morion and stuff, you know what I mean? Yeah. It really sad what happened and all that. Oh, you're we're, from the city? Yeah, I'm from the city, yeah. yeah. Which part city. of the city you from? Uh, I'm from the east. East. Yeah, Where the east. we at right now? We in uh, we downtown right now. This yeah. is downtown? Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah. And at the time, I can't really say like. Uh, all right, so we we somewhere. Know they were, you know what I mean? Yeah, the don't know it's out there. Well, you know what I mean? All right. So yeah. All right, no doubt. Well, I'm not really from the city. Okay. So I came all the way from Saudi Arabia. All right. Yeah, I came to show some respect, no Young Dolph. All right. Key Glocks, way, new bands. So how much planes you took to get here? Uh, two planes, but 15 hour flight. That's right. Yes, That's sir. Right. Yes, sir. All right, man. Well, what's your name, though? Thammer. Simon. Thammer. Okay. Appreciate yeah. it. Uh, you're going to have to spell that for me when I edit it. <laughs> oh, man. It's a celebration for Young Dolph, man. M to three, play a fly, no soda, man. We're going to support Dolph, man. You see what it is, man. Sound Memphis all day, man. You know what's going on. Check us out on the platforms, man. Chi -chi. Uh, Felicia, A.K.K. Fifi, uh, we come to uh, memorial for Young Doll, uh, uh, LAL uh, Precious Tyler, uh, so Paper Route Entertainment. How you feel about? I saw the the, the sign. <laughs> how you feel about that? I think could have been more better. Mm, a little better. I mean, they put a lot of work into it, but it could have been better. I mean, it's all Doll, whether it's him, whether it's not. It's paper right entertainment. And which part of Memphis you from? The city? Parkway Village. <laughs> <laughs> this girl is a fool. We just want to know. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Thank you. We, uh, we doing this shit for young dogs today, man. All the way from the M Town, South Memphis, Black Haven, Navy Garden. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the paper route, everybody. It's, for the, it's dog day. All right. All right. That's good. That's good. That's good. Thank you. Thank uh, you. Thank you. Alright, so uh, my name P and of course I'm I'm not gonna say closely but I've been in alignment with him a while with Dolph a while so, all right, so today is uh, a big day. How you feel about the, the, the sign they put up? You think it could have been better a better memorial uh, or that's good enough for you? It's cool. Okay. Only what people got compliance people that ain't here. What about a Dolph Museum? I think so. I think he could. Mm -hmm. Something big. So you gonna enjoy yourself today? Oh, absolutely. Tell us your one of your favorite dive songs you're gonna be jamming to inside. Uh get paid. Get All the way to get it, get paid. <laughs> Wait, I don't know that. They don't y'all know that? No, yeah. you gotta say the hook or something. Tell us. Get paid, your nigga, get paid. My name is Shalanda, also known as Shane. And if you from Memphis, you understand the movement and you understand what's going on right now. Like, we're here to support. We're here to uh, put on for a legend, uh, the king of Memphis. You know what I'm saying? Like, this Memphis, this North Memphis, South Memphis, Westwood, Orange Mound. Where, where, where part of Memphis you from? I'm from the north. I'm from north. All right, North Memphis. Yeah. Where we at right now? We, we downtown. We downtown Memphis, Tennessee. Okay. Yeah. All right. And and what's one of your favorite dog songs, man? We don't believe you. What's one of your favorite? Man, I like a hundred shots. I like my preach. I like uh, the one R E M B with uh, Nicki Minaj. Which one you tend to like in your mind? You hear in your head right now? Preach. <laughs> she from the Memphis list. Yeah. <laughs> My name is Teresa, and what brought me out here today is Young Dolph. We love Young Dolph. Rest in peace, Young Dolph. We love you. What's one of your favorite Young Dolph songs? Just one. Major. Major? Mm -hmm. well, you know, some of my viewers in New York, they might not know that song. Can you give us a little piece of something? Just, oh, just my God. You going to put me on the spot like that? Ben's on a Mercedes. That's major. <laughs> <laughs> That's good enough. You, you, you lucky you're beautiful, man. You got a real pretty face. Go ahead, sister. Oh, tell me your name. Yeah, my name is Brandy. Brandy. You got you. You this is my sister. Brand. Oh, yeah, this is my sister, Brandy. She's shy. Tell me your name. Brandy, girl. I just said Brandy. My name is Memphis. What's your name and what brought you out here today? Hey, man, we out here for Dolph, man. King of the city, man. King of Memphis, man. KOM, bro. RP Dolph, Long Live Dolph, man. Red Face Shot at Google Me, AGs about me. The whole city know about me, man. Mississippi Boy in the City, man. You know what's going down. Right. Shout out to you, bro. All right. Good looking, man. Thank you. I appreciate you. Thank you. All right. She's like, nah, not me. What's up, fellas? Yeah. Uh, can you show my viewers some love real quick? Man, what it do, man? Uh, wait, no, just hold the mic. Man, what it do, man? This Mark Stark family, man. I came out, man, just uh, fuck with my boy Dolph, man. I remember when Dolph, I first met Dolph, man, in South Memphis. Man, the boy, man, I, I watched the boy grow, man. You know what I'm saying? I did a little work for him on so the look. So Dolph is from South Memphis or North? Do uh, Dolph from South Memphis. Okay. Cascade, exactly. So yeah. That's your neighborhood? Nah, that's your community? Nah, uh, nah, I ain't from over there. Okay. Yeah. But when you met him for the first time, was, was he like big dog or was he starting out? Oh uh, man, he was little dog. He was little dog. In the Cadillac. 
in the Cadillac. Yeah, I met him in the You're Cadillac. Telling us something we don't know. Yeah, look, dog, he went okay. from the Cadillac to the Porsche to the to the race around here, right. man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right, thank you, man. Thank you. Because it's, it's, it's raining right now. I appreciate you. Okay. Right. Yeah, yeah. You see what's going on, man. Sean in HDTV out here. Woo. I had to represent for you, and I will continue to represent for you. As long as I got a. I'm going to turn up for you. Oh, my God. It was a long day, man. Long two, two, three days, you know, but I'm here, man. Yeah, yeah, I'm on the famous strip. Memphis, Tennessee. Legendary city, man, with the music. BB Kings, BB Kings. Blues Club across the street, you know. And it's time for me now to be a tourist. And uh Yeah, yeah. Yeah, everybody, Sean and HD here. It's time for me to leave Memphis. I had a good time. I had the people show me love. The women are very nice here. Very nice. Come visit. And right now, see my bag is right next to one of my favorite things I like to do to kill time. Because my flight ain't leaving till the morning. And I'm here with the owner right now. He showed me much love. What's up, man? Say what's up to New what's York. Going on? What's going on in New York? Everybody, man. How y'all doing out there, man? Yeah, and Memphis, you Memphis. Memphis know about this liquor store. Right, right. Oh, of yeah, course, Memphis of course. know about this liquor yeah. store. But I'm just telling my people the hospitality right. certain people gave me. You know what I'm saying? And you one of them. Right. You know, you didn't say, hey, you, get out of here. Right. Right? right. He could have been right. like, yo, right. dude, what right. you doing right. with that with that phone? You, right. you always right. filming. Right. right. You know what I'm saying? Right. But okay. what I did today was um, I came, well, let me tell you why I'm here. I came down here to get more information on the Dove story. Right. Right, because I feel like people were regurgitating the information and cycling no facts. Right, okay. So okay. I said, let me come down and talk to the people of Memphis. Okay. Let me talk to the people. Right, let okay. me talk to the, the people in the cookie store. Right. Okay. Let me talk to the, the detectives, the, 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 uh, the MPD. Right, okay. Let okay. me talk to the Memphisians. Right. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Right. And you're a Memphisian. Right. Am I saying it right? Right. Memphisian. Right, right, right. right? Okay. It okay. sounds cool. Greek, don't it? Right, right. Memphisian. Memphisian. Yeah. It's right. like it's like if aliens come to Earth, right? Right, okay. And they're like, who are you? Right. You're not going to say your name. You're going to say, I'm a Memphisian. I'm a Memphian. <laughs> a Memphian. That's what I'm Memphian. Memphian. Right. So, man, we here, man. Yo, guys, look. I took y'all to the cookie factory, the cookie store. This is another black-owned business. Right, black on. Black Yo, on. tell tell the people um online. You got a your store got an IG yeah, or anything? Yeah, downtown tell the people, wines right? and spirits. That's us on Instagram and Facebook. Downtown wines and spirits, Memphis, Tennessee. That's yep. right. One hundred and five. And how long you guys been in business? Oh, uh, we just opened up. We've been here like two years now. Yep. Two, two years. years. Yep. Yep. That's strong. Some yeah. business don't survive six yeah, months. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right before the yeah. pandemic. Yep. Right before the pandemic. Yep. Soon as the pandemic. Right. Yep. 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 Well, that's cool because uh, uh, most of the people I know that own liquor stores in New York, okay, it's Asian folks. Right. Exactly. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. A lot of Asian folks own liquor stores. Mm -hmm. It's it, it's surprising that in New York it's expensive as hell. Right. To live, yeah, right, 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 and 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 there's more money there, more right, of an right, income. Right. But I come to Memphis mm -hmm. and I see more black owners of businesses. Right, right, yeah. yeah so yeah. is it is it that you grew up with your dad or something? My your, my, my father, he's always had his own business. Yeah, but so. I'm meaning, did you grow up with your dad? Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. Yeah. I think mm -hmm. that helped. Yeah, they helped. They helped. Because Dolph, mm -hmm. son, made a speech today. Right. And. Yo, the dude, the little kid is articulate as hell. Yeah, right, right, right. And yeah. and and he wasn't crying. He stand firm, and he spoke to. He wasn't scared of the crowd. Right. But that comes from the confidence of having a father. father right. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Right, right, right. So, I would I would like to thank you for your hospitality, right? right your hosp right. hospitality. Right. Exactly. Hospitality. Right. And um, also, I want you to leave a message 
to to everybody that's listening right now because we gotta we we gotta uh, stop the the violence, right? Man. The black and black crime thing. We gotta stop the yes. violence, y'all. Everybody, we have to stop the violence. There's too much going on, and it's like it's just a lot of hate in the world. I don't know if it got something to do with the pandemic or what, but it's just too much hate, and we just need to calm it down, man. Everybody need to come together. But you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get a bottle, and I might get lucky. Okay. If you know what I mean. Right. Because right, I got a few right, hours right. to kill. There's a bunch of shit to do on this strip. Oh, uh, yeah. You know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. And Madison. what's the name of this uh, strip, this block? Madison. This Madison. This is Madison. Madison. Yep. Madison. Madison. So yep. come to Madison. Come to my guy's spot. Say it one more time. Downtown Wines and Spirits. Downtown Wine Experience. Yeah, You're going to have yeah, a good time. Yeah, yeah. Sean and HD TV. You see, I'm talking to the people. This is what it's about. No... Uh, making up stuff, no assumptions. None Come it, and it. talk to the people. Come to Memphis. Come see us, y'all. That's Great. right. And that was pretty much it. Sean and HD in Memphis. And you know, I got to go back because I could have got more. But it was my first time going. And it was about covering a famous rapper that passed away. And the violence in the city is real. Very, very real. So it was my first time. I was a little nervous, you know, and as the day went on and progressed and I met people throughout the day, I felt more comfortable. And Downtown Wines Experience, the owner, he made me feel comfortable. I chopped it up with him, his friend, and and uh, we had a good time talking. His friend also owns a business as well. There's a lot of black business owners in Memphis, believe it or not. But I got to go back, and I'm definitely linking with Downtown Wines Experience. I didn't want to play too much of a lot of the interviews and the shows because I chopped those videos up. You can go back on my page, peruse, and look for those things. I just wanted to show the trip from beginning to end. And like I said in the beginning, I was extremely, you know, cautious even when I was doing the interview with in uh, with with Raven, by that time I was mentally drained, tired, fatigue kicked in, and you know I could have did a way better job, but I got what I got. I said I was going to Memphis. I said I was going to hit the ground. I said I was going to go there with not the iPad but better equipment, and I did a good job. I feel going in a hostile territory, and I'm not from there. Right now, we have to stop the black and black violence. I feel like a black man should be able to go in any black neighborhood as long as you go there with no disrespect and feel safe. Back in the days, we couldn't go in anybody else's neighborhood. That was understood. You would be hung, lynched, terrorized. So why is it that it's 2021? And I got to feel like that. I can't conduct my interviews properly because I'm paranoid or nervous. What's going to happen to me? And that is why I went to Memphis, because I'm tired of us killing each other. And I'm tired of the rumors. Everybody got something to say, but you don't have no evidence, no proof. And why don't you go talk to the people? Communication is key. That would stop a lot of stuff. As you see... I left New York City on a my budget, a shoestring budget. I had a little help from one or two family members, my brother, my cousin, and we got it done. And shout outs to the three people that helped sponsor the trip as well. Carlos Castro is one of them. Yeah, shout outs to Carlos because, you know, more than one time he, he sent something, you know. So we're going to give Carlos his flowers definitely. Like I said, the other people... The other two folks that sent something through that cash app and for everybody that was praying, the prayers were needed. I did see the prayers. Remember that moment? I did explain it. Go look for that clip. So the prayers came in handy. It also gave me the encouragement um, and the motivation to complete what I needed to what needed to be done. And, you know, I learned a lot. Um, I learned the most important thing is that from what I learned is Makeda's cookie store. They has they have nothing to do with Young Dolph's murder at all, and I'm also 
disappointed in the MPD. Um, we don't need another Tupac and Biggie situation with one of our rappers or entertainers. You got all that evidence and you're telling me that you can't solve this crime? Do not Tupac and Biggie the situation. There's a lot of evidence there. Um, so I don't know. The, 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 I mean, nobody came forward and the reward money is high. You know, that's, that don't make no sense neither. So I don't know what's really going on. What we do know is that I did clear up some things as far as Makeda's cookie store. That was the elephant in the room. But once again, man, it was a great trip overall. At the end, I ate some good food. I had some good drinks, you know, and I'm back. I made it. And at the same time, you know, you guys are seeing the evidence that I said I was going and I went. Please share this video because this is an example of a real person in the first place. I'm a real person. I was genuine and I'm not here capping. This is an example to show these YouTubers how to do this. Okay? You 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 the YouTubers that's claiming to be journalists, that's claiming that journalist title, this is how you get it done. Hopefully this would set the trends. This would change the narrative, you know? And we need to share this. This is realness. This is real. This should be everywhere.